Live and streaming from CBS News, New York. This is CBS 2 News This Morning. This morning on CBS 2, a severe crash to tell you about in Queens, leaving a motorcyclist in critical condition. What the city is doing today to highlight victims of traffic accidents. Plus, police continue to search for the driver that hit a motorcyclist in Queens, leaving him in critical condition. That is the story we'll have a live report on from our own Christina Fan. And we've got the latest on the war between Israel and Hamas, plus the weather. We got a lot going on this morning. Thank you. Morning. <laughs> Thank you for waking up with us. It is 7 o'clock on this Sunday, November 19th. I'm Andrea Grimes. And I'm Dave Carlin in for Doug Williams. Much more on our top stories. But first, the weather. And here's Craig Allen with your first alert forecast. It is starting off cold this morning. Take a look at some of these temperatures. If you're getting out the door now, make sure that you have a heavier jacket on. It's not windy, but that has allowed the temperature to drop. St. Francis is funded by city agencies and charitable donations. Conte, most of the tenants are referred to St. Francis by city agencies. Anyone interested in more information, head to our website, cbsnewyork.com. It's so nice to see that part of because we see the homelessness and we see and hear the stories of trying to get people off the streets, which is very difficult. And so to see the permanent housing part of it is really nice. And community. And the community. And support exactly. for each other in that community. Well, thank you for spending part of your Sunday morning with us. I'm Andrea Grimes. And I'm Dave Carlin. We're back at 8 o'clock with more local headlines. Jets game day is next.